Welcome back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back. Um, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to some more Pokemon Armonia. Um, crazy shit happened last episode, man. Crazy shit. Like, we had saved, um, we ain't really saved cuz, but, um, I forgot. Thiago, I think his name was, um, was lost, and his grandpappy, who was a part of, like, um, Nidia and Ko was here, and we fucking guided him, cause he couldn't battle for his life, and now we're here. We're in some type of desert city where they want to, Nidia and Cole want to do some like crazy scientific shit to the ruins and they, I guess they don't want that to happen. So now let's go look for this damn gym leader who I believe is right over here in the Nelios River doing some shit with the youth. Um, Simpist, we're here. Did we miss anything? No, not really. We've spoken to the citizens. I ain't speak to nobody, Nick. I just came over here. They told us that um, the gym leader would be around here. Come on, Lucas. We're missing the start of the Gimkana. Huh? What? Excuse me, ma'am. Could you let me and my brother through, please? Sure. She she called she called me ma'am when I'm only 26 years old. Damn, she a baddie for 26. Ooh. Oh, that was a harder, cheap shot than a bishop. Bisharp. Oops, my bad. <laughs> Excuse me, children. You can now come in. Thank you, Mr. Scientist. Come on, Lucas. Oh my God. Please don't hold it against them, Mary. They're only children, after all. Anyway, let's see. Look, you're, you're, you're look, being a, a ma'am is, oh, hey, what's good, what's good right here? That was shit. That was awesome. Hello, everyone, boys and girls from Kalima City. Ah, and greetings also to the visitors who have signed up for this activity. Today, we meet to start the 14th annual Kalima Ginkana treasure hunt. Oh, nice. Many of you are repeaters for, um, many of you are repeaters from last year, but for the newcomers, I'll quickly explain what this event is all about. As I'm telling you this, my assistants are replace, are placing five balloons all over Kalima City. These balloons contain clues that will give you some very interesting information about aquatic Pokemon in the Safari region. To get through the Gymkhana, you will have to get at least three clues and give them to me. This is not an easy task, since you will have to face the rest of the participants to get them. Oh shit, man, bitch, this is gonna be easy. Look, aquatic Pokemon, me and Woody, this is a desert? And their water? Man, I'm trying to get this gym badge, man. You will also win a guided visit. Fuck all that. Stop. No questions at all. Uh huh? Why you got questions? I have one. None? Nobody? Perfect. Wait, come on. <laughs> I know she didn't do that. Are you serious, bro? <laughs> Yo, that's so mean. But I don't blame her, though. I don't blame her. They're going to ask, like, these creative ass questions and shit. And if it's going to be, if she took her, then the other one was going to have, like, another crazy-ass question, like, can a guard chomp pop out of nowhere and, like, eat my sister, and then if they don't eat my sister, blah, blah, blah. Uh, hi, excuse me. My name is Haim. I'm an intern with Professor Mary Burkia. We're conducting an investigation, and we need you to let us into the pyramids, please. H Hello? Definitely. So far as people are like a spray duck. Simpus, it seems that this girl is not going to listen to us. If she's just going to keep ignoring us, we won't be able to continue. An idea has occurred to me, though. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Uh, we have... Let's yell at her to hear us? No, I don't think... She's... She look like she can, like, fucking send out whatever big Pokemon she got and beat my ass. We have to win the gym cup. Exactly! You have to win the scavenger hunt, or whatever it is, the gym kinda, so you can open the way. I'd love to help, but... You... You called me, ma'am. I have a problem to take care of, nigga. <laughs> Listen, anyway, I'm going to try to cheer up. I'll leave the rest up to you. We'll be here waiting for your victory. Say less. I got this. Woody, where you at? Um, Donnie, you going to have to bounce. Woody, let's get the fuck into this little challenge right here. Kalima City. Yo, Ayana, what's good? Hey, Simpis, how are you doing? We're um, Professor and Haim. You get out my sight for a while, and I'm already more lost than an artillery in a garage. Okay. Simpis tells Ayana all about the Gymkhana. What? Whoever passes this test will be able to face the leader. This is my time to prove that I'm better than you. I'm not going to be left behind on shit. You'll see. Okay, she's out of there. So who the fuck do we talk to? Let's see. I am going to find out right now, y'all. Oh, okay. There it is. Um, It looks like one of the balloons. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to be looking for balloons, not talking to people, dickhead. Do you want to exploit it to find the clue? Yeah, sure. Hey. I'm going to get the clues. I've prepared a lot for this moment. You're not going to get in my way. Bitch. Pumba? If you don't get the fuck out of here. That weak ass shit too. Beat! Oh wait, I thought that was going it was a crit. I thought I was gonna like one-shot him and shit, but I guess not. Boom, get clapped. 
All right, let's see. Donnie's level 25. Nice. Low sweep. Okay, okay. Donnie, you are learning a lot of um, fighting moves, bro. You got to learn something different. You got to be, like, more, you know, unique. Oh, I wanted to have a battle with Ann. Bitch, you're not going to find that anywhere soon. Oh, well, let's wait for another year. Oh, sorry, little one. Track two. What's good? Hey, the clue reads as follows. Track of the Gymkhana. It talks about Uglish, an ancestral Pokemon considered the ancestors of all terrestrial beings. Okay, nice. Hello, hello, sweetheart. Boom, boom, boom. If I want to challenge Leader and to a match, I have to win this. Those clues will be mine, nigga. Bitch, another nigga, Timon. That little clapper. Uh, we'll do Pro Feather Bop. He's gonna. No, not really. Should have used something else, buddy. Laters. Uh, any hoosies. Hatina. Hatina can get hit with this. Boom. Why are these whole ass niggas not getting one shot? See, Hatina can fucking fuck me up. If she has, like, the second evolution of Hatina on her team and it's a flying type too, bitch, she's gonna fuck me up. Woo, man. Listen, I'll wait another year. Who cares? Well, good luck on the rest of the test. Bitch, mad as fuck. Anyways, track one. Cool, cool, cool. Clue reads as follows. Track of the Gymkhana. It contains information on Samabkuba, a water dark Pokemon. Okay, nice. Um, Sankuba is a water dark Pokemon, because I feel like I have to remember these shits. Sakumba is a water dark Pokemon, and... Huh. Okay, so apparently this bitch is very strong, and she has a strong tactic that can help me beat this gym leader. But she's very strong. So go for it. What do we got here? What do you got going on? Talk about you mad strong. Let's see what you got. Um, first of all, we're going to hit you with this, right? And then we're going to hit you... No, you know what? Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's actually what we're going to do. We're going to do these two right here. Boom. Boom. So that way, he doesn't get in our way. So this is perfect. This is perfect. Boom. Why'd you hit agility? Uh, we'll do this. And I want to get rid of you first. I want to get rid of you real quick. Flail. That ain't really going to do much. Boom. Let's get you out of here. Why would you hit that? Boom. All right. Cool, cool, cool. So that this is kind of easy. She, uh, well, I mean, I guess. Uh, I, I, I wouldn't really know. Um, I'll take away agility for Roost. Definitely gonna need Roost. The fuck? Boom, boom, boom. And you can get hit with this, because I don't think anything will really do anything. Boom. Okay, nice. I didn't re What? Leaf? Oh, well, I mean, Leaf Blade. That does make sense. It is, it is a physical attack. I was about to say, how the fuck did I get hit? No, that was my secret. It can't be. Uh, what? That was your secret. Charge Beam. You didn't even use Charge Beam. Bitch. I don't need the only useful thing. Oh, hello. What are you, Nib Nile? I want you. Uh, put you to sleep. Don't know why you would even do that. Oh, makes more sense. Uh, hold on, buddy. Please relax. Uh, wait. Hold up. Relax. 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 Dive ball. Um, you do you live in the sea? Maybe your water type. Thought that would help. You're like more of a camouflagey type Pokemon. Hmm. Boom. Perfect. Nip. So I ended up switching the team up a little bit because it would make more sense to have like, oh, hey, there it is. Um, looks like this is like the last balloon. Hey. Oh, shit. I wasn't really expecting. I was expecting to fight her like after the gym. Um, hi, Simpist. How are you doing with the Gymkhana? How many leads do you have? Bitch, I already got two clues. Well, I have to tell you that I have two others. The one in front of you is the fifth and last one, huh? Fifth? What's wrong with you? You know what that means, don't you? Shit, only one of us can keep this. Say less. Let's see if you're really ready for this, Ayana. Are you really ready for this gym battle? Let's see. Yakucha? Uh, we're gonna send out Big Turd right here. Turd is gonna get hit with the poison tail. Ain't gonna do shit to cuz. He gonna, she gonna like really make him hit another poison tail? Third poison tail? Boom, one shot? Come on. Ayana, listen. You're not really ready for this gym battle yet. Bufflin. What's a Bufflin again? Oh, I know what that is. Let's send you out. So I did change up the team a little bit because I, I didn't want like my team look. Hello? Because I didn't really want my team looking crazy and shit. Like there was like two, I already got like two flying Pokemon in here, but I really want just want to see. I only have Hagler in here still because I want to see what his third evolution looks like. Other than that, Vam, 
Bam and Dua. Um, I'll send out Donnie for you because I really don't know what you are. Oh, read that shit. Uh, low sweep. Low sweep. Not too bad. Not too shabby. Ayana is getting is kind of getting there. Lily. Oh, she fucking did her shit. Oh, she got Lily. Nice, nice. She didn't really. It, it's not really a Safar region fossil Pokemon, but it's still a cool looking Pokemon. I don't get it. Dot dot dot. We set out on a journey together at the same fucking time, and yet you still turned out to be better than me. I've studied your shit. Why can't I even get to the bottom of your shoes, nigga? Look, you gotta just train like me, Ayana. I feel like as time goes by, the difference in level between us increases more and more. And now with this defeat, I have to wait to challenge the gym leader of the city. Oh, I'm so sorry, Ayana. Um, but look, just do your best. I know you'll be able to beat me one day, because maybe someday I won't even have like the good Pokemon. Okay, later is fun. The clue reads as follows. It's about Nib Nile. Um, Pokemon that has lived in the Nilos River for thousands of years. Nice. So we got the clues. Anyways, let's go show these niggas. My fault, y'all. had to heal up real quick. But yeah, like I was saying, let's go show these niggas what a real fucking gym battle is, nigga. Oh, look. Go to the Nilos River real quick. Yo, what's good? Fuck out my way. Um, oh, I can't get up there. Hello? Hello? Um, ma'am? I have your... Oh, wait. I think I'm supposed to talk to you. Hello, Simpsons. How's the test going? I already got all the shit. What's good? Um, you're amazing. Now all that's left to do is to win the gym badge. Hey, girl. You look like a Magikarp stuck in the water all day. <laughs> it's about time <laughs> you get out there. Simpsons has all three of the clues. I see. Let me see them. Damn, she was just going to take that. She's not going to say shit to her? Inconceivable. Tourist has managed to win my treasure hunt? It hurts me that none of my children won. But the rules are the rules, I guess. I'll be in my gym. I hope you memorize the clues well, because you'll definitely need them, nigga. She got two nib -niles. Well, Simpsons, you heard her. I guess we'll have to just wait here again until you're done. I guess it's gonna be quick, don't worry. Well, Haim, don't lose heart. I'm sure there are some very interesting treasures along this river. Bad day to leave my swing. Girl, I would've... Mm, you're as optimistic as possible, huh? As always. All right, uh, what are we doing? Okay, so we're gonna go battle cuz. Jitney? Um, so we're good. Uh, how do, is this the gym? Oh, this is the gym, oh shit. Weird ass entrance for a gym. Are we under? Oh, this is the aquarium type gym. Uh, yo, how about the? Oh shit! Welcome to the calamity. Blah 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 blah. blah. <clears throat> so let me explain the mechanics of the gym. It's pretty simple. To tell you the truth, okay, nigga, just tell me it. Like, tell me all this like weird shit, crazy shit. In each area, one of my teammates will ask you a question. If you get it right, you can pass. If not, it's your turn to fight. How can you know the answers? Very simple. The answers will appear um appeared on the clues that you've collected during Listen, nigga, I know it. I know all about this shit, cuz I got real good memory. Welcome to the dot 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 blah 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 museum. Please answer this question before you face um Miss Anne. Samakubwa is a Pokemon that lives in the rivers of Safar. It has a big appetite and it does not let strangers enter its territory. Shit, for real? It's a water dark type, nigga, and the answer is water dark type. Look, I'm about to just go battle this chick, like, off the rip. Um, are you one? Wait, this area of the aquarium is only available to sell. Wait, what? Who is? What the fuck? You're not even, you don't even work here. Oh, she's a Karen. Maybe? I don't know. What's, like, why did she have to, like, fucking include herself into what I'm doing right now? My gym badge. My gym challenge. Talking about this is a secluded area. Bitch, you don't own this gym. Unless you do. No, you don't. Fuck out of here. You don't even look like the type. What's good? Oh, hello. I can bring native. No, I'm cool, bro. I really don't care. Shut up. Um, hello. Millions of years. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, those are Tortugas. Nice. Hey, stop there. This is a restricted area. I, bitch, weren't you supposed to ask me a question? Holly World. Get clapped. Laters. Boom. Yo, this is an easy ass gym. Especially with Woody right over here, bro. Hyper voice, thank you. I will definitely take that for. Um, Proto Fetter really comes in clutch sometimes, but I'm gonna take that for Proto Fetter, I guess. It can, it like comes in clutch sometimes, but who the oh hey, well before facing Miss Anne, I wasn't even trying to. Did you know that the first forms of life arose in the sea after millions of years of evolution? A small Pokemon made its way onto dry land and evolved into a life form capable of breathing air. Many think that this was the first Pokemon to evolve and after achieving it, many followed in its footsteps. 
Could you please name this Pokemon? Oh my god. Um, Samogen? Is it Uglish? Uglish is the ancestral Pokemon, right? And the answer is... Oh shit, okay, phew. Down, bro, because when I read the Uglish part, I only read the, the part where it was like an ancestral Pokemon. I didn't really like read the other crazy shits. What's good? Welcome to the blah, blah, blah. I don't really care. The Nilos River is one of the most recognized locations in the Safar region. As usual, though, many different species of Pokemon live in this place. Is that so, nigga? Because I, I only seen like regular desert Pokemon. That's it. And who's this bitch blocking the stuff? Is that Nip Nile? Some of these creatures have inhabited it the Nilos River for centuries or even millenniums in Mies. In fact, these days they are quite common to see actually. Could you say what is the name of these Pokemon? Blah, 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 Nib Nile. Yeah, thank you. I was paying, hello. It looks like this Pokemon could take you where the gym leader is. Oh, do you want to ride it? Sure. Let's go. Bum, bum, bum. What are those Pokemon in the water? They look actually nice. Um, Can you take me back? Oh, I can't go back. Bump, 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 what's up, baby girl? I'm here to challenge your gym. If the history of evolution has taught us anything, it is that life cannot be contained. Life breaks free, spreads across new territories, and breaks down barriers painfully and even dangerously too. This is one of my favorite phrases, and one of the ones that best explains why I dedicate myself to this. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where do we come from? Are we really the fruit of superior of a superior being or is it all a story that hides the truth of our origin who knows that's a it's really good to like think deep like that Anne. but i do know who you are and i do actually agree with you too i always think about stuff like that too when it comes to that but anyways water pokemon are cool and all but i'm scared of the water so let's fight so i can clap you and i can get up out this gym let's get to it yes now where is the music oh i'm just dancing to shit Damn, bad, baddy ass at all. Like, look. Crocosis. Boom. Oh, you're that water, water grass type. And you know, Ice Fang. Bop. But you still can't clap me with all that. Phew, Lord have mercy. Yo, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I actually did panic when it come to when it came to that. Uh can I send you out? You know what? You're tanky, maybe. Oh my god, what are you? Uh, let's see. You're tanky, so I'm gonna keep you out here real quick so I can do this. He's a water, no, water ground type, water ground type, water ground type, water ground type. Grass should do good on here. Uh, super fang of us. He ate the little warm berry. Rest of. He needs snooze. Damn, flea storm. Fucking A. You are really embarrassing me right now. I should have actually re fucking healed him up. Boom. There you go. You wasn't shit. Bop. Mmm. Samakubwa. Samakubwa. What are you? Oh, shit. You're a Samakubwa? My Pokemon are against the current river. Okay. I didn't hear a word that she just said, but boom. Samakubwa, please. Oh, my God. Thank you, Samakubwa. Laters. A little pretty nifty gym battle. Wasn't really anything too crazy. But we got Hagler up to level 27. He wants to learn Pluck. Pluck is a mighty strong air move. So I'm gonna keep that air move. Flying type move is what I meant. Um, Lethal Stinger. What are you trying to learn? Lethal Stinger. Uh, let's take out Tackle for that. Boom. Tackle was gone. Lethal Stinger. There you go. My team's fluidity. Blah, 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 blah. Impressive. I could say that the waters were in your favor, but they are not. <laughs> that victory is 100% due to you and your Pokemon working together. I give you this well-deserved Kalima City badge, the Tail Badge. I think her badge is like the more cl most clean. The Story Metal too, Story Badge. That shit is like super clean. Uh, ah, yes. As a result of your victory, I will accompany both you and the Professor um, to the Origin Pyramids. And if you want to get out of here faster, you can use my dear Sakumba. She will take you to the gates of the gym. Hey, Anne! Oh, shit. Man, Sippus, how's it going? Oh, this nigga again. I suppose you've come here to challenge Anne. Um, I already beat her, twin. What? You've already won the gym badge? You're leaving us at a level of the Grimer. What the hell? Um, I have 
Well, Ann, I've come here to ask you for a favor. Asking me for favors is a lot, and saying a hello is a lot, too. I see that you left your education in the tavern. Damn, why is she on his case? Ahem. <clears throat> hello, Ann. Uh, could you please do me a favor? What's it all about, my stout fellow? <laughs> you know Ayana, don't you? I've heard about her. She's the girl with the extravagant um, hair, right? I want to ask you to give her the option to challenge you to combat. Even though she hasn't passed the quest. What? She ain't passed? Impossible. The Gymkhana is for a reason. If I give her the option to challenge me, then I should allow all the children to do the um, same thing. My job as a leader is a hobby. I'm dedicated to research and education. I can't waste my time fighting kids all the, all the time and all day. That girl has potential, but her frustration at not surpassing Simpis prevents her from improving as a trainer. So what she's doing is go So what she's going to do is quit. Do you really think do you really think that making things easier for her is going to make her better? Question mark. Her fault is being her fault is not being a bad trainer. The root of the problem is her is her need to compare herself to others. True. Each trainer improves at their own pace. Comparing herself does not bring anything good. Damn, that's true. That's true. I think what she needs is just a little motivation, nothing more. I'm just asking you to do this for me, please. I remind you how many times I've done you um, the favor of bringing you home after spreading the whole day, after spending the whole day in my tavern. All right, all right. I'll do you the favor, although you should know that I totally disagree with your decision. Simpist, I'll find Ayana and I'll let her challenge me. Thank you. Hey, that's what's up. Look, I, I, I'm actually looking like to not like being super good in this shit because I'm starting to feel really bad for Ayana. But hey, a nigga's gotta do what a nigga's gotta do to be the very best. You feel me? That was really fast. I'm so sorry, y'all. But this is the end of the episode. Thank y'all for this beautiful adventure. I will catch y'all on the next episode. If y'all are liking everything so far, please leave a like down below. If you do would like to see some more Pokemon. Um, episodes, please feel free to subscribe. I will catch you on the next episode, video, whatever it is. Laters!